now looking really good after uh, some spritzes and sprinkles yesterday, then rain last night. We finally got rid of that cold front, <coughs> excuse me, that brought all of the rain to the area, uh, especially uh, last night. But the good news is it's also taking some of the humidity out of the air as well. We're going to get some sunshine today. High pressure building in from the plains will uh, keep things dry, not only uh, today, but tonight and probably most of the day tomorrow. Cold front off to the west, though. We're going to have to watch that. That'll get in here uh, probably sometime tomorrow evening or night, and that could bring a chance for some strong possibly severe storms. We're going to go with an alert day for tomorrow evening because of that. Uh, right now, though, closer to home, it is quiet out there. Temperatures now ranging from 44 in uh, Sparta, 50 in Black River Falls, 54 in La Crosse, 54 in Winona. And there we are at City Cam, the sky getting lighter and lighter as the sun getting ready to present itself for the day. So let's look at the numbers uh, from the airport. 54, the dew point at 50, our humidity at 88%, a south wind at 6, and the river at 8.61. It is holding steady. And as we look at our forecast highs for today, they will top out in the lower 70s across our far north, places like Bloomer, Menominee, and Kadat. Heading southward toward uh, the uh, I-90 corridor, generally uh, anywhere from about 73 to about 75 degrees. And then down to the south, plenty of sunshine. Look for our temperatures again. Uh, mainly in that 73 to about 75 degree range. So let's put our maps into forecast here and uh, we are forecast maps into motion here for you. Sunshine today as that high pressure ridge moves across the area. We'll see a clear and seasonably cool night tonight with low temperatures dropping back uh, into the 50s and a few of our cool spots in the 40s. Now, as we head through the day tomorrow, most of it's going to be dry. And in fact, we should see some sunshine for a good part of the day. But as we head into tomorrow evening and tomorrow night, we're going to watch a cold front slide in and that could bring a few scattered thunderstorms. And uh, we I'm going to have to watch that line. There could be some strong, possibly severe storms uh, as we head through the uh, evening hours and the first part of the overnight. So we'll keep our eye on that very, very carefully. Heading through the day on Wednesday, though, we dry back out, but boy, do we cool off. Uh, there is our severe risk for tomorrow. It is a uh, Category 2 or a slight risk. So look for scattered, strong to severe storms, mainly uh, as we head into Tuesday night. So our allergy report, still quiet on the ragweeds and weeds, but molds uh, running on the high side. And again, that is because we've seen so much rain. And what we really need is a, a killing frost or freeze to really kind of uh, put the allergy report to bed uh, for the year. But at the present point, uh, it doesn't seem like we are anywhere near that type of weather. So for tonight, down, uh, for today, I did it again, Jen said so tonight for today 74 mostly sunny and pleasant west winds at around 5 to 10 and then 55 tonight a mostly clear and seasonable night and then as we head into tomorrow 80 mostly sunny during the day but we pick up that chance for thunderstorms uh, as we head into uh, Tuesday night and again some of those could be on the strong side so we're going to watch that very very carefully in the meantime our eight-day forecast showing a bit of a cool down behind that front tomorrow night only near 70 on Wednesday and Thursday Another front enters the area for a good shot at showers and thunderstorms on Friday into early Saturday. We're going to watch that because, of course, we've got the Maple Leaf Parade and Oktoberfest weekend. Big weekend for lacrosse. Another shot at some rain Monday and Tuesday. Temperatures in the upper 70s to lower 80s. That is a look at our local forecast. We shall be right back.